spinny, spin, 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 spin. It's windy again. I'd rather do it outside then. And so here's the dog. Hey, Diddy Man. What's up, boss? So nice. Look how cute he is. Cute little doggy. Hopefully it's not too windy. Anyway, um, I don't really see too much today. I'll try to get that wind not so it's blowing. But yeah, it's, um, I don't know, I've been out geocaching, walking around, watching some movies, or YouTube, doing a Sunday thing, even though it seems to be what I do with the other days. Um, so, I don't know, the thing that I'll, I'm interested in the most at the moment is still the whole Middle East. Um, for instance, you know, Yemen and uh, Bahrain, Bahrain and uh, Algeria, they are all getting, all the civilians that are peacefully protesting and getting their beats. Sadly, it's not good. However, the thing that's uh, struck me I know, two days ago or a day ago, um, mainly coming through yesterday, was the fact that um, the people that are uh, the Jewish settlements on uh, Palestinian lands, the UN had a resolution put forward to uh, go to Israel and say, hey, what you're doing is illegal, you shouldn't be doing that, uh, they're building settlements on uh, Palestinian land. The USA, in their always wisdom and everything, um, decided to veto this. All the other 14 nations on the Security Council said, go ahead, let's uh, tell the Israelis they need to stop doing this building. Um, but uh, yeah, USA decided, no, we do, uh, we do not believe that this is the right call of action. Uh, I think, I, I actually don't understand why they did it, but I think it was because they wanted to send a letter from the President. It'll work, I think. Something like that, a letter. Anyway, if it was from the UN, it would make more sense. But it's, um, I don't know, the whole Israeli friendship thing. Now, I'm not, I'm, I'm for, I'm for Israel, alright? I'm, I'm, go for it. However, what they do to the Palestinians, especially in the Gaza Strip, is just awful. It's awful. They are stopping people from living. Simple as that. And then they go, on, particularly on the West Bank, and, provide, and, and start building their own settlements on someone else's land. Now, there is uh, so much tension going on there, but when they end up building on other people's land... Imagine, imagine people went to Canadians just decided to go across the border and start building on American soil. Americans, being them, would not want this, would not have anything to, of this. They'd be throwing their tantrums and throwing their toys out of the cot, and, um, you know, that probably beat up Canada if they wanted to. But, um, yeah, when another country does it, and they're like, no, we'll just send a, a letter. Go look into it. It's very confusing why they decided they, they don't want to have this. I'm very confused by it. Because they want it to happen, or they say they want it to happen, but it's not working. It's not it's not providing the peaceful means. Whatever. Oh. It's just another one of those steep things which they're just doing. They're just getting in the way of world peace. They they talk about world peace and democracy. They're the biggest evil out there when it comes down to actually not doing it. When it comes down to the people of America, awesome, good on you. I lived with you. I loved you. Uh, but when it comes down to your politicians, you need to get rid of them. Ron Paul is the only way to go. And if I was over there, I'd be voting Democrat. Ron Paul's a Republican. Ron Paul, all the way. Anyway, that would be me today, and um, yeah, talk tomorrow. See you. Wait, 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 remember building seven. Yeah, spinny, spin, 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 spin.